Hey everybody, I'm a little behind on the news. It's been a minute since I made a video. So let's get caught up on a few things here. Alita Bellinger will be on Disney Plus in Canada in April. It will also be on Netflix in Canada as well. No word on if it's coming to Netflix in America at all. But, you know, we keep an eye on that. And this is from what's on Disney Plus. So Canada's getting the the goodness when it comes to Alita. Um, then, well, if you're interested, also, if you're interested in reading this, that Foxfire wrote about who owns uh, the IP rights to Avatar and Alita Battle Angel, um, you can read that there. I believe we had pretty much settled that it was that it was um, James Cameron but if you were looking for uh, a lot of evidence well then you can find it there now um, we are having a, another Alita art contest that is mostly going to be Vladdy and I believe last time he had some other people helping him out with that but as far as I know Vladdy is the head on this one so if you're on Twitter or even I guess Instagram or I don't know if he's on Facebook or not, but um, we might be able to find your artwork too if you put it on Facebook. Just use the hashtag Elite Art Contest and maybe we'll be able to track it down. And yeah, go to the blog to see all this, the details about that. Now, um, I guess this is the last, yeah, not one more thing after this. So, April is also the last month for Elite Battle Angel on Hulu. Um, as you saw, Alita is debuting on Disney Plus and Netflix in Canada, but in America, it is actually leaving Hulu, so that kind of leaves one to wonder if in America, Alita may be coming to Disney Plus or possibly Netflix as well. We don't know. It may not be in April. Maybe it'll be in May, or maybe it won't happen at all, but... This is something that we're going to have to keep an eye on. Excuse the noise. This is something that um, is very interesting because we kind of think, well, Disney owns Hulu, right? So if Disney owns Hulu, you would think that it would stay on either Disney Plus or Hulu. But Hulu probably, because it's probably more, um, it's, it's, it's better then it's better for Disney than Disney Plus would be because Alita, let's face it, is not exactly, I would say, in my opinion, it's family friendly, but I guess it really depends on what you what you determine family friendly really means. Um, I took my children to see it. I, that wasn't really a problem for me. So, um, but for Disney, maybe there's a problem. But if it's leaving Hulu, then where is it going to go? And, and if if it's not going to be on Hulu or Disney Plus, what I mean, how, there, there's some questions here because Disney has the distribution rights. So as far as I know, that really can't be revoked. I don't think it can, but clearly something is going on so who who really knows what's happening right now but it's kind of an odd thing to happen um to see a leader leave hulu that's it's kind of an odd thing so we'll you know we can ask questions about what's happening behind the scenes and you know but we're, we're just speculating so um just keep an eye on that i guess and for the last thing if you can go and vote for Alita in this poll you will see the link this is the original tweet that we that we came across and the link will be on the blog for you to go I will click it now actually so that you can see what you need to do go to this website as soon as it loads I don't know why it's taking so long to load uh, well here so you just go to the um, checklist here and since Alita is not on the list you will have to type Alita Battle Angel in there is it loaded up yet not yet and some 
I believe it was uh, um, Mario. I think it was Mario who said it. But you may have to sign up for the newsletter. It's still not loaded up. You may have to sign up for the newsletter in order for your vote to count. And if you want to use a burner email account, just do that. Oh, there it is. It's loaded up now. So you may have to sign up for the newsletter in order for it to count. Just type in Elita Ballinger here and vote. And the person who posted this poll is actually, uh, if I can get this to load too, it's taking a minute. Okay, his internet is, I don't know what's going on with it, but he, can I get it to show here? Nope, I can't even get it to show here. He is, um, who is he? He is the only, the owner of that website, but also the host of the Next Best Picture podcast, and he is a Critics' Choice member. So, who knows what, um... I mean, he has a pretty large following, so who knows what might be able to come from this poll if Alita gets a, if Alita wins or, or comes in pretty high. So please vote for Alita in that poll, and that is pretty much all I have. Um, sorry for the for the long period between videos, but I'm still here and I'm still working on other things. <laughs> I'm working on other things. And life and other things were elite related also. So, um, thank you all for watching. Later.